Explore mementos. Two targets. Let's All go. Right. I'm gonna bust loose. And what I will do this time, actually, is I might not show everything in mementos because, you know, some of the random battles get boring after a while, I'd imagine. So, I'll obviously show the boss in quotation mark mm. fights. Um, and I might show, like, new zones at the beginning, at least. Uh, yeah. Huh? Rain might have an effect on mementos. Um... Mm hmm On days with bad weather, like rain, mementos will be more dangerous. However, this is also a chance to get extra items. Enemy reinforcements will be more common, but sometimes there will be rare enemies. Also, the items you find may be more valuable, and there will be a greater number of chests. Make good use of these chances. Yeah. That's nice. That means today's our chance to get ahead. Well, I don't think we can expect the rain to have that much of an impact. Well, let's go! Okay. Let's begin our beautiful work. We shall. We shall indeed. Uh, right, so. Give me an overview. Right, so they're in there. Potentially... You know what, let's just go here, yeah. Go further down from there. Hmm, I'm sensing the target in a preceding area. Okay. Right, so we'll head back from here. Uh, I might just unlock the next one after the Kaneshiro thing is actually over, which, you know, might take a few more days. So, I guess I will be back once we found our target. A new skill for an diorama, which restores medium amount of HP to one ally. There you go. Forget about that. All right. And there we go. Hmm? There is our target. Hey. Let's go. Okay. There it is. That should be the shadow of the man named Uchimura. He's abusing his girlfriend, right? Didn't her fortune say she's gonna get hurt bad? We can't leave him like this. We need to change his heart and fast. We will, we will. Don't you worry. This is horrible. Damn it, I gambled away all my money again. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Where is she? Get over here so I can beat you. Don't beat your girlfriend. Don't beat anyone, really. What? Don't you dare lecture me. She's mine, I can do whatever I want with her. Beating her is a right that only I have. I'll have you know that she loves it too. If you want to get in my way, then you're gonna die. Uh, I don't think so. Splendid. I'm gonna punch you too. The opponent is strong. Persona. Don't do anything reckless. Of course. Uh, okay, he resists that. Oh, of course. Persona. Uh, what about some fire? Okay. Persona. Hmm. What about a physical mm -hmm. attack? What? You gotta ah. Okay, attack up. Out of our way. Hmm. High chance of fear. That's good. Let's go. Ah, you know what? Let's just attack normally. Okay, resist that. Alright, Queen! Beautifully died! Persona! Me on my rage! That should do enough damage. Nope, doesn't. Never mind. Let's just keep going eventually. Why did it turn out like this? There we go. Nice amount of experience, nice amount of money. And a new skill, energy shower. What's that? Cures confused, fear, despair, brainwash, and rage for all allies. Okay. This is horrible. I hate it. I hate it when people look at me like I'm just a bug to them. I can do better. I'm a superior human being. All the people around me just don't get it. Sleep stick. 
wanted to beat his girlfriend. He, re he was really the worst of the worst to think that. We changed his heart, so let's go tell the fortune teller when we get the chance. Okay, so what actually is that reward we got? Uh, yes. Let's keep going. A blunt weapon able to put foes to sleep. Well, who can equip it? Uh, certainly not me. Ah, uh, Ryuji can. Yeah, sure. Okay. If we go a little back towards where we came from. Well, we came from somewhere further down. So do we have to go down or up? A chest! Talk about luck! That is slightly confusing. I think we're probably supposed to go up, to be honest, with how that was phrased. Which would mean it, it was phrased wrongly, but I do believe that's what the game means. Sitting in a sunny patch on a clear day? Huh? Okay, was further up, yes. Let's go and scour this floor in as well. Well, I mean, we don't have to scour it for very long, it seems. There we are. Huh? Yes, then let's go. Oh! There he is. It's Odo, the shop manager. What an unpleasant smile. It's his customer service smile, right? Yet behind the scenes, he's extorting his subordinates. Like, this guy might start doing it to his customers too. Who knows? Huh? That would be a disaster. Let's go. Welcome, welcome. How may I help you, ladies and gents of the Phantom Thieves? Why'd you blackmail your own employees? That's not normal. My shop is a directly managed store of a large chain. Since I'm highly competent, I'm in charge. I don't need strangers complaining about how I use the shop's money. Part-time workers are the property of the shop. Thus, they are mine to use them. As I will. What? Property? Who do you think you are? I get it now. You pretend to be heroes, but you're all just criminals. I'm gonna kill you. Let's go. Outlaws who dare trespass in my sanctuary, prepare to be royally obliterated by my hand. It's time. Uh, how about no? Oh, great. That's just fantastic. Right, well, he doesn't even get a turn to attack. I'm sorry, am I really not worthy of being the store manager? You're fired. No, I remember now. Employees aren't property, they're human beings. And yet I took advantage of them. I've done bad things. Talk about a horrible workplace. I don't know how I can ever make up for this. You've done quite a bit more, haven't you? It would be best if you just confess everything. Chinese sweets. What? Huh? Aren't those Chinese desserts or something? I see. So he was lining his own pockets. There we go. All right. I will actually keep exploring a little bit, uh, just so you know. I'm gonna go to shows. Uh, yeah, Jose, one time, just to see what he's got on offer because we've got like 89 flowers now and. There might also be something else. Anyway, I'll be right back. All right, here we oh, are. Mister. Hey, Mister. Oh yeah, we got that crystal. Yes. Here you go. 
Yep. Put that there. Put that here. All done. Now it should do you some good. Here you go. Okay. A ring of gluttony. Yep. Right. We have one point. The question is, do we want to do anything with that point? And, well, the answer to that is no, because we can't. Um... I will just store 50 SP to one ally. Increases Persona's luck by two. Yeah, okay. And the tool that can only be used in safe places stores 20% SP to all allies. That is useful. So I'll take that, please. And then with 65, confused. Well, I mean, we really don't need that, but it, <laughs> it's exactly the amount we have. So... I bought it. All right. It's dangerous to walk around somewhere this dark. I'm so glad that Mona can turn into a car. Yeah. And I'll just take one cancer? second if I'll I can actually anywhere, navigate. Anytime. Just to check that that uh, thing down there is still closed. Certainly seems closed, yep. certainly still closed. All right, then we will go to the entrance and back out of Mementos. Uh, oops, uh, exit. Oh. Uh, actually, you're right. I realized something. Do you need something? I want to ask again about what personas we need for that contract thingy because I realize we do have access to Jack Frost actually. Do you need something? Oh yeah, also this happened. Uh, the alarm. What was that? Oh, assignments are on hold. Okay, well. Pursue rehabilitation with all alarm your time. body and, and soul. For the wisely. We might as well make the alarm you time okay happen then. Uh. What else? Do you really need this? No, I don't. It is neither remarkable nor are you okay with this? What if we go with this? It is neither remarkable. I see. This uh. is certainly a power. Is this something you need? You know what? We will actually you go okay with this. With this? Choose yeah. which skills to inherit. Um. Increases technical damage by twenty five percent. Strengthens magic skills targeting all foes by twenty percent. That seems good. Uh, I mean, that all seems terrible. I mean, I'll inherit it, but I don't want any of it. Okay. Yep, you can happily change double shot. Do it. Regenerate two instead of regenerate one, which stores four percent of max HP each turn in battle. That seems good. Greatly increases evasion from nuke skills. We'll take it. We'll gain sledgehammer and dodge sigh. That seems like a fairly solid persona. Okay. And this is its power. I don't want any of that, really. What? Done already. What? Uh yes, uh, I wanna go back. Yeah. And we exit. Oh. Yep. Crosswords. Hey, hey. Crosswords, yes. Play. Where art is shown off and sold at an auction. Uh, oops. Wait. There is no C. Oh, is wait, is there? No, there is no C. Okay, now I'm confused. C T I O. Wait. C T I O. It would fit. Okay. 
mustachioed surrealist. I'm gonna assume that's Dali. Which means that isn't uh, a race that one. That isn't actually that. Paris Museum is the Louvre. There's tons of others too, but that's the one we'll cross with puzzle ones. And wall artwork. Um wall artwork. Hmm. I don't quite know what the game wants from wall artwork. So that could be any of it really. Um Hmm. I can spell gamble with what I've got left over. Um, A L. Oh, gallery. Jesus. Okay. I mean, usually you sell at an auction house. Uh, I mean, I guess you can. You have. You definitely have galleries where you can buy the paintings that are on show. Uh, it might even be the more common one, but all right. A room or corridor where artwork is on display. The gallery is also the area where observers group together for all sorts of events, from courts to golf tournaments. It can also refer to society at large, especially in regards to the majority opinion or even a passageway made by an animal, such as the tunnel system of a mole. All right. I see. Nice. Yep. More knowledge. All right, let's. And now we can not go outside. Hey, hey! No, I'm not tired today. Let me out. Hmm. No leftover ingredients. God damn it. Okay, then we can just watch TV. Oh. Because we rented ICU. This man is a convicted criminal. Yet you want to save him? His guilt or innocence is for the courts to decide. My only concern is that he lives long enough to get there. It's a story about the daily struggles of doctors working in an emergency ward. Wow. I like this guy. A person's life is valuable, no matter what they've done. Yep. No matter the circumstances, those doctors never gave up. Maybe you learned a thing or two about kindness from watching mm -hmm. this drama. No, no. Oh, we've reached July. Hey! Nice, we got a seat. We can read. Hmm. Knowledge about internet crimes. Read to enrich your knowledge. Is filled with kindness. Yes, we'll read Buchiko's story. Hmm? And so Buchiko kept waiting. Mm. Buchiko, the story about this dog makes me cry every time. <laughs> hey, hey. Hmm? Oh, I didn't realize how long you've been reading. Yeah, we haven't finished yet. Our eyes were so full of tears that we couldn't see anymore. I skipped breakfast, so now I'm hungry. I want something filling, but with summer coming up, I'm worried about having too many calories. Why don't we get tea? The dinner in Shibuya serves fruit tea. It smells good, it's great for your skin, and it totally increases your charm. Fruit tea? What a cute name. Sounds yummy. Being stylish starts from the inside out, after all. Guess I'll try some. Wow. Fruit tea, huh? Sounds like a hip drink that's real popular with the ladies. You want to try some? Sounds delicious. Nice. No rule against dudes drinking it. If it tastes good and makes you more stylish, might as well, right? It might be a good idea to boost your charm by drinking fruity whenever you're at the diner. Good morning. What are you looking at? Let's get going. We're going to be late if we don't hurry. I wasn't even aware there was a diner in Shibuya. To be honest. Is that the place I've been working at occasionally? Well, 
Shall we begin? Open your textbooks. Today we'll be talking about the Free Kingdoms period. A variety of heroes battling for dominance. Truly an epic time. Charismatic rulers and warlords with the command of a thousand men may have their own appeal, but personally I think that the strategists who support them can't be ignored. Now then, in the book Shu Ge Liang of Shu, which is totally not how you pronounce that, is famous for his exploits during the Battle of Red Cliffs. He's also the inventor of the Baoji, a kind of round dumpling. But their original name was based on their appearance. What is the answer? What's the meaning of the original Chinese phrase that these dumplings name comes from uh, came from? I'm gonna go with Warlord's Eye because it's the only thing that's round. Hmm. I'm afraid not. Nope, apparently not. Logic goes out the window. Its original name, Manto, came from a phrase meaning a barbarian's head. Okay. No reason why I should have known that. At the time, one region's barbarians would use a person's head as an offering to soothe the deity of a flooding river. But Zhuzhlia, that guy, made that thing in the shape of a head as a substitute. These days you can find Baoji, maybe, with cute faces on them. If you think about their origin, it's not too off the mark. I never knew strategists came up with cooking and not just strategies. Makoto's our strategist, wanna see what she can cook up? Alright, who wants something from me? Maroki, yep. Let's go. Yep. Now. Well, today's just going to be another back and forth as usual. Or will it? Today's your lucky day. Please take a look at what's on this table. Um, I've been making you listen to all this tough stuff about traumas, pain and grief lately, so... I found these cookies in an underground mall. Now we can have a little break. They're kind of fancy cookies too. I thought I'd get a surprise for you since you've been kind enough to indulge me all this time. Go ahead, enjoy. <laughs> I could just take cash. This looks great. Go on, don't be shy. I've got enough for seconds too. Oh, yes. I know, as long as we're talking about cookies, they actually reminded me about this psychological experiment. The scientists prepared two containers and put the same kind of cookies in both of them. In one container, they put only one cookie, but the other one was filled with cookies, ten of them. So... Then they had their subjects try cookies from each container and asked how the tastes compared. Which container's cookies were marked as tasting better? Any guesses? Uh, the one cookie container. Right. Correct. Easy to guess, huh? There's something called the law of scarcity. It's about what you'd imagine from the name. People are drawn to things that are more scarce. You can see this law in action just by observing how excited people get over limited edition merchandise. You know, you're right. <laughs> I know, right? Don't you think it's really fascinating? In becoming aware of scarcity, we trigger our own desires and cause a change in our cognition. Not only that, the effect spreads to our senses and creates a subjective, observable difference in our reality. Basically, your perceptions can be changed by your cognition or preconceptions. <laughs> it's all below the conscious level, but it's really incredible. Incidentally, now that you've heard that story, how do you feel about that idea? That your unconscious desires may have changed the taste of the cookie? <laughs> hey, as long as it tastes good. <laughs> That's definitely not the usual response, but it's one I can understand. It probably sounds like an exaggeration, but something about that seems so beautiful to me. Maybe the human heart can falter or be unreliable sometimes, but if this experiment proves anything, it's that even a simple preconception can be enough to bring someone more joy. For example... Take that story I just told you. What if you'd eaten that one cookie and it had been the best cookie of your life? Say I never revealed the trick behind it. That cookie would have remained more delicious than usual. It would have been a subjective truth of your reality. I guess so. Right, I'm glad to hear you say that. Basically, what I wanted to say was... 
If this idea of preconception could be studied further and actually applied to treating people, I feel like it could help a lot of people, maybe even more than I could help through counselling. Then again, it relies so heavily on perspective. Some people might call it a lie or see it as running from problems. Still, even if that's true, I still believe that method could save a lot of people. Sorry. Oh, yikes, I'm so sorry. We wound up getting into an academic conversation after all. I really need to watch myself. Whenever I'm talking to you, somehow I always end up going back to my research. I truly am grateful for everything you've done, not just because I can get your opinion on these things either. It's more like it's as if I'm talking to an old friend. <laughs> but maybe that's too personal. After all, this is all for the sake of our deal, right? <laughs> so we say, anyway. Rank 5. Chance to restore Joker's SP when it is low. Very right. welcome. Now then, I'd better show, off, uh, show you another way to mentally train yourself. What I'm going to teach you today is... Nothing. All right. More max SP. Oh, and here, never a bad time for a snack, right? Don't worry. Well, <laughs> see you. Make sure you get home before it gets too dark, okay? Will do, will do. Oh, this is Maroki. Sorry about earlier. It was supposed to be a chance for us to relax, but it ended up being another big academic discussion. <laughs> Come on, man. It was thought provoking. <laughs> really? Wow, I'm so happy to hear that. I've always been like this. I get so hyper-focused on my research, I don't notice anything else. Back when I was a student, people kept warning me about that. <laughs> Oops, there I go rambling again. Sorry, sorry. Alright, see you again soon. Yeah, I've got some sooty armor. Secondhand clothes store and Kichi Georgia will take them too, but we'd better do something with them. Maybe not. Oh, you got a big lead? Well, that would be interesting, but I can't do it today because we gotta go. Yeah, we gotta go to Shinjuku and talk to our favorite fortune teller. The only one we know. What do you think? Well, did her fate change? Fine, let's hear it. Please sit down. G goodness gracious! Her boyfriend stopped abusing her? I don't believe it, but even if he did stop, her fate should still be heading down the path to misery without changing. I mean, look! What? The sequence of Arcana has completely changed! Death has moved far off into the future. Fate is not absolute. No, no, no. This must be some sort of trick. What are you, a scam artist? You made a deal with her boyfriend or something, didn't you? I didn't make any deals. Then what did you do? Did you plunge him into Tokyo Bay? <laughs> or cram him into a metal drum and dump insects on him? You must have taken some sort of extreme measures. I'm just an ordinary student. Well, you certainly do seem ordinary. Yes, quite ordinary indeed. But there's no way that could have happened without you breaking the law. I mean, how could an ordinary high school student change the course of fate? Fine, I'm just going to have to verify your power. The very power that reversed my tarot card prediction. This is quite a serious situation for a fortune teller like me. I need to get to the bottom of this. You won't have to do anything. Just sit next to me while I tell fortunes. And if another unopposable fate happens to appear, then I'll test your power. Uh, I get nothing out of this. Well, that may be true. Oh, I know. I'll read your fortune. Please? I'll even prioritize your readings over my regular customers. Besides, I'll be able to provide much more accurate predictions once I get to know you better. How does that sound? Is it a deal? Hmm. Otherwise, I won't be able to go on. Please, I beg you. 
I need to know if fate truly can be changed. All right, I guess. You will? Really? Okay then. I look forward to verifying your skills. Please don't blow me off, okay? We made a deal after all. I've made a deal with Chaya. 